for our guardian taste test, we are going to try the Chipotle black bean burgers, the crispy orange chicken, the pizza pockets, the breakfast patties, and then the fishless fillets. The crispy um, mandarin chicken does come with a sauce, so we will try it with the sauce. My name is Chelsea, and we have my husband. Colt. Hi. And we are going to try some of the Gardein uh, meatless options. We have the black bean burger, the breakfast patty, two um, of the chickenless nuggets with the mandarin orange sauce, the fish fillet, and then the pizza pocket. So we have had all of them except for the fish fillet and the pizza pocket. So we will go ahead and taste and tell you what we think. What are we okay. starting with? I don't care. Let's start with the mandarin orange since that has the sauce. And I just bake these in the ovens uh, according to the instructions on the package. So I think that these are a really good option. Um, I like the crispy texture on the outside. It's a little bit different than the crispy tenders. The crispy tenders are more like a pinko, kind of crumbly. These are more just like a solid um, breading. What do you think? I concur. There still is a good crunchy texture to it, so if you're making that transition from what I remember of, of real orange chicken, uh, very close. And the sauce is pretty good. Alright, what do you want to try next? The fish filet. <laughs> so I used to like fish and now I think about it and I'm like, why did I actually like fish? Was it really that it was tasty or did I think it was good for me and that's why I ate it? I don't know. But this is like a crispy, kind of like a fish and chips option. So um, that is what it's supposed to be replicating. We've never had this one before. So. It is definitely flaky and crispy. So those are good traits to have. And it's fishy. I would say that tastes just like if you were to go out into like a fast food type of fish place and get like a fish sandwich or anything, I would say it tastes very similar. What do you think? Concur. It tastes fishy, which is weird. Um, okay, so let's try the black bean patty next. We both had the black bean patty. I really like it. My kids really like it, so. Maybe try some. My son's over here asking if he can have some. It's so hot. It's hot. It's Alright, let's cool down. Okay, so that one I think is really good. It tastes like beans. It has a very good <laughs> has a very good consistency. Um, I think a lot of black bean burgers have kind of like a really mushy texture and like they fall apart really easily, but these do not. They are very tasty and they have a very good like chewy texture to them. And they have like uh, corn inside, different um, peppers. So. They have a very tasty uh, taste. It's not hot anymore. You gotta bite it and tell us what you think about it. Okay, tell us what you think. Mm -hmm. Do you think it's yummy? Mm -hmm. Can you tell us your name? Camden. Camden. <laughs> oh yes. Uh, and you think the black bean burger is a good one? Yeah. Okay. What do you think, Colt? Let's go with. What do you think about the black bean burger? Oh, uh, it is, it's good. The texture is good because it holds its shape. It has a good texture. Uh, most of my, most of my eating concerns usually relate with texture and that texture is very close to what I would expect a regular hamburger to be. So I don't personally think it's like a regular hamburger. I think it is definitely a black bean burger, but I think that that's good. That it's kind of texturally similar for you. This, uh, we're trying the breakfast patty next. I already know that I don't really like this one. Uh, it's not my favorite. It definitely has like more of like sage. I actually like it more than I, I remember liking it, which is good. I just remember it had like a funky aftertaste. 
And I would say it's good, especially if you had like a breakfast sandwich. It would be a good option. Plain, not my favorite. Sure. Yeah, definitely you, you would need to have that in conjunction with something else that is not like our normal breakfast patties. And the, so the texture is good, texture is very similar, mm, maybe not the same, but close to what a breakfast patty would you would expect out of a sausage patty. But the taste is, is not quite there. So, concur. Okay, so the next one is the pizza pocket, which we, it's like a pepperoni style pizza pocket. Neither of us has tried. Um, I think this is one I am most excited about just because what it kind of, mom? it's a pizza pocket. It kind of might bring us back to mm -hmm. what we thought of when we were younger. Like we used to always eat the pizza pockets um, when I was younger and I know Colt had those when he was growing up too. So, all right, we can go ahead and try that. So I think it is really good. I think it has a good pepperoni flavor. Um, there's not too much artificial cheese, which I'm glad about. So I'm pretty picky about that. Um, I would say that our, the fake cheese, whatever style of fake cheese it is, it has a little bit of an aftertaste for me, but I would say it's pretty good. Um, the breading is really sweet, like the roll portion. So yeah, I would say it's pretty good. What do you think? Uh, I would also concur. I'm pleasantly surprised. So the More like the initial taste well, of the the pepperoni is like you initially all the textures are there and the initial flavor okay, flaw do you think of like oh wow this is actually just you like a hot pocket the <laughs> aftertaste i guess which could be the cheese i'm not sure um it is a little bit off but still overall good what did you think was the best thing that you tried today mm. From a perspective of just enjoying the food, I would probably say the chicken, the with the, oh, the mandarin chicken, the mandarin chicken with the sauce. Um, I would. What was you, what were you most surprised about? Like, what were you most surprised? Like, oh wow, this tastes. I mean, obviously we've tasted them before, some of them. But what are you most surprised tastes? The pizza what? pocket definitely surprised me the most. Okay. My favorite thing that we tried, I would say, is the black bean burger. I really like those. Um, the thing that surprised me the most was the fish fillet, because um, it was super crispy, which I like, and I just did not know it would taste like fish, so I was really surprised about that. What was your favorite, buddy? Um, <laughs> we'll come back to him. It's a little bit more. <laughs> okay, so would you buy all of these again if you bought them? <laughs> Uh, probably not the breakfast patty. Okay. So I, I agree. I've never really been a huge fan of the breakfast patty. It's okay on a sandwich. Uh, it's nice too because it's about the size of a sandwich, like a biscuit or anything like that. So I would say it would be good for that. I would say I would buy everything again. Um, just some things are more of my favorites than other things. Awesome. Oh. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What did you like today, buddy? What was your favorite? You don't know? Out of these. Okay, all right. All right. <laughs> well, thank you guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. It was a really fun one, kind of doing something that we have not done before and trying some new vegan products. Uh, we don't really, we do eat uh, mock meats, not every day. I would say probably once a week. Uh, my husband always jokes that we replace Meatless Monday with meat alternative Monday. We don't eat them every Monday, but kind of just like once a week, that type of thing. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I am not the originator of this video or this style or idea of video. It's Kimberly Flanagan over at the Kimberly Fan Flanagan YouTube channel. She kind of, uh, I think came up with the idea and she's done a couple of these, um, the Gardein and then the I think it's Halo Top. I've never had it. It's got ice cream. So go check out her videos if you want to see some other vegan um, products and some kind of reviews about those products. And I will have her linked in the description box. So if you enjoyed this video and you enjoy my content, please give my video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And give me a comment about what kind of Gardein products or kind of like mock meats that you guys enjoy eating or if you have any ideas for different videos or something else we should try, just go ahead and put it in the, in the comments. I hope you guys have an amazing week.